seven years ago when I was in the Philippines, I wouldn't have thought that, hey, in seven years, you would be running your own Android meetup. I would have said, you're crazy. Growing up, I was part of a big family. I had 30 million cousins. No, not really. <laughs> My dad moved to the Middle East to work, and so it was just my mom raising my brother and I. This community I lived in was a poor community. You might get stuck in traffic because there are cows crossing the road, that kind of stuff. When I was just beginning to learn Android, I started doing those simple exercises online by myself and asking questions in Stack Overflow. One of the first answers was from a Googler who actually worked on the Android API that I was asking about. And I felt, I felt seen. I worked hard, learned on the job, but then there's also this emptiness because starting my career in the Philippines, I felt like I was the only Android developer in the whole city. I got an opportunity for an Android engineer in Sydney. It was still really difficult because I'm going away from my family. But then I wanted more challenges, so I thought, why not? First, I felt like no one would pay attention to me. And I didn't have a degree to back me up, but maybe they see something in me that I don't. And with this community of people online, I felt more and more confident in my skills. I started participating in Android meetups, and I realized how different it is having Android developers in front of me who I can bounce ideas off of. This is a really good feeling to be with people who speak the same language as you even though we're all from different countries, but we all speak Android. And I'm really proud that I'm able to take care of my parents after all the sacrifices that they'd made. The Android community really changed the course of my life.